Divide a decimal by another decimal. You need to be able to multiply a decimal by 10 and 100 and divide a decimal by a whole number. Multiply a decimal by 10 or 100. When we times a decimal, we move the decimal point to the right. If we times by 10, the decimal point moves one place to the right. If we times by 100, the decimal point moves two places to the right. Examples Example 1 2.34 times 10 Times means the decimal point moves to the right. 10 moves it one place. 2.34 times 10 equals 23.4 Example 2, 0 0.34 times 100, times moves the decimal point to the right. 100 moves it two places. 0 0.34 times 100 equals 34. How do we divide a decimal by another decimal? Follow these steps. Get rid of the decimal in the denominator times by 10 or 100. What you do to the denominator, you must do to the numerator. Do the division using the bus stop method. Examples Number 1. Work out 1.84 divided by 0 0.4. We need to get rid of the decimal in the denominator. To do that, we time 0 0.4 by 10, which gives us 4. What we do to the denominator, we must do to the numerator. 1.84 times 10 is 18.4. Now we do the division 18.4 divided by 4. 4's into 1 is 0. We carry the 1 over to the 8. 4's into 18 is 4, with a remainder of 2. We carry the 2 over to the 4. 4's into 24 is 6, with no remainder. 1.84 divided by 0 0.4 equals 4.6. Number 2. Work out 0 0.625 divided by 0 0.05. We get rid of the decimal in the denominator by multiplying by 100. 0 0.05 times 100 equals 5. We must times the numerator also by 100, which gives us 62.5. We divide 62.5 by 5. 5's into 6 is 1. Carry the remainder of 1 over. 5's into 12 is 2. And carry the remainder of 2 over to the 5. Put down the decimal in your answer. 5's into 25 is 5, with no remainder. 0 0.625 divided by 0 0.05 equals 12.5. For practice questions on dividing a decimal by another decimal, visit us at www.11plusgenie.com.